Hey guys, I just want to give you an update. So I am working on trying to get to a safer place. Um, I don't know what's going on over there in Salida, but uh, yeah, something's going on. Like the snow started and everything. So the fire, I guess, stopped maybe. But I noticed that night that the whole fire is going crazy. I go over to Buena Vista in the mountains and then there's no wind blowing. So that wind is definitely generated. That fire is definitely done on purpose and all that. So it's like, I already, when I see shit like this, I, I just got to bounce, you know, I, I, I don't, I don't know what's going on, but things are really bad. I'm pretty much, I had a safe place as being in like rural areas, but now these motherfuckers are coming here to gang stalk me. There's people coming from California. There's a big, thing of Californians I'm gonna say I'm just gonna say it like it is these fucking reptilians from California and Texas are coming and trying to nest in Colorado in the Rocky Mountains and these motherfuckers are nesting in the Sawatch Mountains because remember that remember that video I had and that lady's like oh well I have 30 days by Sawatch County to their obsession is with the Sawatch Mountains that's what they're trying to get into these fucking reptilians from California and in Texas and whatever the fuck else and Ozarks wherever these people are coming from I, I, I don't know but it's like you know what if I'm gonna deal with all this bullshit if I'm gonna deal with all these uh planes flying over my head constantly all this shit and these people following me around bringing their gang sucking technology and shit to rural places I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the fucking city and and, and y'all want to fuck with me so you know if I'm gonna deal with all this bullshit I can deal with this shit in the fucking city you know, so I, I don't even know what to do at this point right now. But I know that these motherfucking extremists from California, especially are, are in Salida area and whatever. And I, I don't know. I don't know. But shit's fucked up. Head now. west and, on um, East 5th Street toward Harrison Avenue. Right now, then turn right onto so Harrison Avenue. So I'm glad about that because that keeps these fucking reptilians away. For some reason, these people that are stalking me from California, Nevada, and Texas, these motherfuckers don't like snow. They don't like snow. And I know that for this past year, they've been doing something to alter the weather here in the Rocky Mountains so that it does not really snow because this we, we have not gotten a real winter. And I wonder if we are going to get a real winter this year because I need to be where there's the most snow to keep these fucking lizard, these reptilians away from me. They won't stay the fuck away from me, you know, and I in know that they don't feet, like snow. Continue so, straight to stay on Harrison yep. Avenue. That's where I'm going. I, I, I just need to get away. is waiting in his car for me and on his cell phone. Whenever I start moving, these demons get so fucking stupid. So I got two fucking red cars near me. Just, just pathetic. So I got another one. I come out to my car and I'm sitting here between these two. It's like, huh. Yeah, well now she's getting out of the car because I guess they realize, oh, once they see that, you know that oh i've been sitting in the car too long and oh i'm gonna get out the car because oh i'm too fucking suspicious so yeah of course you're in a white car so of course of course i know what this is and then this other one in this blue car next to me and this bitch looks really fucking pissed off or whatever the fuck looks really fucking these motherfuckers are so mentally ill man this is sad yeah Face is all fucked up. Oh, here we got another one pulling, on, one pulling up from fucking Massachusetts. All these people are following me from other... I'm not saying that this specifically is, but a lot of people... I just keep seeing all these cars from other states around me that are, are following me on the road. And they usually don't have a front plate, so... Well, this is my day. See how much more people follow me while I'm fucking traveling. Because it's just every time I start moving, it's like, oh, we gotta start following her and all this. And, and just fucking... Got another creep here waiting for me as, you know, I have to use my location and my GPS. I don't have a fucking choice. So sitting here and watching this creep, of course, it's just waiting here, just staked out. It looks like they have some alcohol, a can of alcohol down there or something like that. So I'm just putting my high beam fucking headlights in their fucking face so they could see what it's like to be gang stalked. You know, it's really pathetic. And of course, they have no front license plate. So it is pathetic. It's just like, wow, you know. This motherfucker really just does not have a life. He really does not. It's pathetic. It's just, like, so sick. I'm, I'm just gonna just leave because this is just pathetic. It's just so pathetic. So, guys, this gang stalking has been out of control as I've been trying to move, like, 
wow, I don't even know what to do at this point. Like, it's so bad. Like, I basically last night had a fiasco. Like, basically because that white car was there waiting there for me, specifically waiting for me at that trailhead where I needed to have a spot to camp for the night. Yeah, and it's out in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, this motherfucker is waiting for me. So this gang stalking shit has gotten crazy. It's just getting, like, really... These people are getting really desperate, and um, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, but I'm just, like, really just... I mean, it's so crazy, and that's how I figure, oh, you know what? Let me just get to Denver for a minute, because, you know, everywhere I go, I'm being fucking gang stalked anyway, so I, it, it's just a mess, but... Anyways, I'll keep you guys updated, and, um, yeah... So, this has all been just interesting just to see how, wow, I'm moving, like, okay, and then, um, yeah, so, I had to park on the side of the road last night, in a snowstorm, basically, well, not really, I mean, we weren't, we're not really getting, like, real snow, but, you know, I had to park on the side of the road, so a sheriff comes, the first thing a sheriff does is take his flashlight and, like, is anyone in there with you? Like, basically, all it was about was seeing if somebody was with me. So, this person who's stalking me is definitely obsessed with, like, my whereabouts. And if I'm with, gonna, if I'm with another man or whatever, that's what it seems that this is what this is about. Which is ridiculous. It is ridiculous. So, anyways, take it each day by day and I will keep you guys updated.